live data models power Sysense dashboards to run queries in real time from Cloud Data Warehouse. The recent Sysense product release gives us the ability to use custom columns for live data models, which helps data engineers and data modelers gain greater agility in their data transformations. I have a model and I want to add a custom column. So I can do it from the menu in the model itself or from the navigational pan panel menu. When the editor opens, I have all the fields from the current table. I can select any of them or enter my own expression. Here, I've selected my own expression and I can also parse it and preview it. As you can see, a new custom column was created and it appears here in the table. I can edit it or rename it and I can see the data type specified and the expression. If I try to change something that's invalid, I'll get an error. By the way, I can still save it as a draft expression, but I'll get an error message. And when I go back to editing, I'll see my last draft saved. As a dashboard designer, by adding calculations and transformations on the column level, I gain additional fields I can use as is or as a basis for more advanced calculations in the widgets. Another new capability for live data models is the ability to add predefined drill hierarchies. Predefined drill hierarchies simplify how your viewers can dive into their data. With SciSense's Drill to Anywhere feature, viewers can select a drill down path from a complete list of fields, but it's often easier to select a frequently used drill hierarchy from a short list. To start, select Manage Hierarchies. If this is the first hierarchy you are adding, select Add Hierarchy. Select the field. This will be the first field in the drill hierarchy, and the same field used in the widget. Click Add Field to add the next level in the drill hierarchy. Repeat this step for as many levels as you need. You can opt to always include the field, and you can always edit the field or the hierarchy name. You can add as many hierarchies as you need, and when you're done, the dashboard designer will have access to the hierarchies in the widget designer, and will be able to select and add them to the widget. Both custom columns and predefined drill hierarchies have long been available for our Elasticube models and are now available for live data models. This is another way SciSense is strengthening its commitment to working with Cloud Data Warehouse data and enhancing the data modeling experience. Join the SciSense Q3 release webinar on October 20th to learn more.